This is unbelievable, everyone. We're taking an ice cream cone on a plane across America to go see Malak. Of course, there's a huge problem we have to overcome, and that is that ice cream melts. Oh, no. <laughs> And that's why I made a fake scoop of ice cream. But you would never guess it was a fake scoop of ice cream because I scooped out a real scoop of ice cream and then made a fake scoop that looked exactly like it. Just because it's fake ice cream does not make this an easy process at all. Going through TSA is always nerve wracking when I do one of these flying with food videos. So my hands immediately start sweating and made the cone soggy. My days of hard work and planning can be thrown away in two seconds. Dylan, you know you want it. Yeah, don't tell Malad, but I really don't like Subway. I like their bread though. These videos are by far some of my favorite to make, but sometimes they can be so awkward to film. Wait a minute, that's insane. I have to hold the ice cream cone the entire time to make sure it does not get messed up. I got an ice cream from this place and I took it all the way across America. It did feel really good that I was stopped multiple times, people telling me that the ice cream I was holding looked so good and they wanted to know where I got it from. <laughs> Oh my god. So much work went into making this ice cream and then getting it all the way across America, but it was all worth it because of Malad. But some things are always true. I'm banned from the Gucci store. <laughs> I love Malad, but I hope this doesn't ruin our friendship because I made this fake ice cream a year ago. And at this moment at 10.15 p.m., the boys have posted the TikTok. The hardest part is saying goodbye, but just know it's actually a see you later. Wise words from Dylan.